got some very, very, very special guests, so I'm going to be real brief. But what this call is intended for on Wednesday afternoons or for those of you who are not part of Immunitech yet or perhaps a well-meaning friend, relative, neighbor, or even perhaps a stranger has told you a little bit about Immunitech. So I'm just going to give you a couple of highlights about who Immunitech is. Uh, first of all, we've been in business for 21 years, so we're not a startup business by any stretch of the imagination. The reason for the success of our company is the fact that we market a product that is unique, a product that cannot be bought anywhere else but from Immunitech. It's a product called Immunical, and it's the It's a product that is the re result of research done at McGill University in collaboration with three immunologists that worked at McGill at that time. And in collaboration, they helped to uh, found and create a product called Immunical, which, as the name suggests, must have something to do with the immune system. And it does. And fundamentally what it does is three primary things. Number one, it helps you to remain healthy. Uh, what does that really mean? You know, we're, we're, we're still, you know, I know we're in March here in Dallas where I live. It's getting warm. I know there's people up north that are dealing with the north, nor'easter that's taking place on the east coast, uh, snow and cold and rain and all that wonderful stuff. <clears throat> but we're still in the midst of cold and flu season. So just to remain healthy, what does that mean? It means you feel better. It means you're more productive. It means you spend more time with your kids and your loved ones and doing the things that you want to do in your life as opposed to being sick. So if, if our product only did that, it would be certainly worth something that you might want to consider certainly taking. Uh, in addition to that, it also helps you to get smarter. And uh, who doesn't need that? I mean, needless to say, uh, we, you know, we all need that, so it helps you to become smarter. Uh, our company is, is engaged right now in the midst of uh, several brain studies uh, that are indicative of the fact that, once again, the product helps you to uh, get smarter. And finally, Something that's very close to my heart is it helps you to become stronger. Uh, I'm an old athlete. I'm 56 years old, but I'm, I, when I'm done with my calls here today, I'll be at the gym. This is bench press day for me on Wednesdays. Uh, I lift weights with a bunch of other guys, and, uh, you know, real important to me that I'm able to still, you know, push weight. But, you know, whatever you want to do, whether it's, you know, you run the 5K this weekend coming up in your town or perhaps uh, – you know, you play softball with a bunch of other people, or perhaps you're uh, in your local bowling league or curling league or whatever it happens to be, or maybe you're even crazy enough like some of my friends that still play hockey in their 50s and 60s. Whatever it happens to be, that, you know, that's up to you, of course, but you want to be stronger and you want to be able to go out and have good muscle function. And once again, our product helps you to do that as well. So fundamentally, healthier, stronger, smarter is what this product does. Now, as you can imagine, when you have a product that does those three things, People are going to flock to your door and want to buy that product. So we've been able to create a business that people are able to do on a part-time basis, in some cases on a full-time basis. Uh, in some cases, uh, like Keith who introduced the call and myself and the people that uh, you're going to meet here shortly, uh, we're able to do this even on a full-time basis in some cases. But, uh, you know, once again, it, it'll fit your life. So if you're leaving that business meeting, if you're – uh, going between luncheons this afternoon, if you're going between appointments this afternoon, whatever you happen to be doing, we have something at Immunitech that is for you. Now, one of the people that really helped to lead the charge here with Immunitech that's been part of us now for uh, these 21 years that I've been involved with Immunitech uh, is a young lady up, up in Canada. Uh, her name is Lori Carlovarlis. She's done a great job with the business, and she has a very, very special guest that you're going to want to listen to her story this afternoon. So I'm going to turn it over, the balance of the call, to my good friend Lori, and she will introduce our special guest. Lori, are you with us? I am here, and uh, thank you, thank you. I'm, I'm very excited to introduce, introduce our special guest this afternoon. Um, it has been... I'm trying to think of the years, about 14 or 15 years when our guest, uh, Karen, who I'm about to introduce, and I met, um, along with our friend Fosta, who I, I think is on the line with us also, and um, she joined us. She joined us in Immunitech, um, had some, you know, had some, some, some success. In fact, we were just talking the other day, I mean, uh, her and I uh, earned that trip to Vegas when they, when they did some of those smaller trips back then. So... But, you know, I think a lot of people on the phone, as life would have it, sometimes life gets in the way and uh, your life changes and, um, you know, without getting into details, Karen ended up, you know, going through a divorce and, and life changed. So fast forward, you know, we sort of, uh, we, we disconnected for many years and it's, it's, it's really odd how it happened and I'm going to ask to share the story, but 
uh, my friend Fost and I, who, who worked together with Karen, we had just been talking um, because there's been so many changes, positive changes with Unitech. It was always a great company, but, you know, in my opinion, it's, you know, right now it's really poised for greatness. We've got some new ownership that has that's very visionary, young, and, and, you know, they've hired some great leadership around them. So, you know, Fost and I were talking, and as we were talking, let's, we need to find Karen. And we couldn't find her. We couldn't find her. You know, the obvious, we checked Facebook. Lo and behold, we didn't know she was in her maiden name. But at the same time, she was looking for us. So I'm, I'm about to, I just want to introduce uh, my very good friend, Karen Wilson from Grand Bend, Ontario. Karen, are you with us? I am, and I'm excited to be here. Thank you. And i got to tell you, Karen was actually losing her voice. She's been talking so much, so... Um, kind of ironic. But Karen, can you share, when we're both looking for each other at the same time, how it came about and um, why you were sort of looking for us? Because it, it really goes to show the power of the product. Well, um, as you say, I was involved in the company 14 years ago. And yes, I ended up with a divorce and life changed. And I went back to my maiden name. And um, I was still taking the product, but I wasn't actively selling it just because my life got in the way. And um, eventually my credit card declined because of the situation I was in. And I ended up um, meeting up with another fellow, and we were taking the product. And um, one of my buddies that was my original customer from 15 years ago went, saw him uptown and said, are you still taking that product? And at that particular time, my credit card declined. And the gentleman I'm with now said, no. And he goes, well, I can tell because you look terrible. <laughs> and he, he came home and he said, why are we not taking that product anymore? And I said, truthfully, my credit card declined and I didn't want to ask you for your credit card. <laughs> and he said, I think we need to start taking that product again. And I said, I totally agree. So I called Immunitech and I just signed up as a customer under FOSTA again. And Foster and Lori called me immediately and said, Karen, we've been looking for you. Are you sick? You're taking the product again. And that's just, it changed my life. I'm back at it. I'm excited. Um, and that's my phone ringing. I'm sorry. I'll go to another room. <laughs> that's okay. But anyways, I, um, yeah, it just, it, I'm back on it again, and I'm excited. And I talk so much now, I lose my voice. So let's. I really want to share with um, the listeners on the phone because, you know, it was important to see sort of, you know, it was the product that, that brings you back. Um, and you know the power of the, this business and this industry. And so yes. uh, you decided to, to take it to another level. Now, Karen just joined in um, after the new year. So it was January. January 1st, exactly. Was it? Okay. Yeah. And so then she got on the product, and, and I want to talk about what's happened since then because, you know, um, Karen started really um, sharing with some of her closest friends. So do, do, do you even want to share just sort of what you did because, um, and then I want to get into the next month, which we'll introduce, but just what you did to get started to create some really great success. Well, I was really excited again to be involved with you and FOSTA, and um before I even got my kit, I started to tell people because I was excited, and I'm still excitement, excited, and I think people hear the excitement in your voice, and I just started calling people, and people, excitement is contagious, and when you're excited and you're passionate about a product, people want to be a part of that, and I called you, and I said, okay, what do I do? And you told me, okay, Karen, you need to go out and get three people and help them get three people. And every time I got someone, I called you to help me because three-way calls work wonderfully. And then I kept saying, what next, Lori? What next? And if you follow those steps, it's so easy because you're, I, I don't know, it's just you're driven by passion. You want to share that with everybody. And you know that everybody needs the product. That's a phenomenal thing. And if they say no to you, they're just saying no, not right now. But you're still planted that seed, and you'll have a really good crop later on. 
Exactly. So, so you know, and it's really, it's really key because I think when I see a lot of uh, new people, you know, I try and remember when I was there, you know, there's there's some that try and really evaluate, you know, what what the marketing plan is, what you know, how many, what do I have to do to. You went out and talked to people, and you utilized um, myself and Fosta, you know, through three way calls. Um, yep. and Wally and and you know some of the people on the line. Now Karen also, as a brand new consultant, um, signed up to go to our conference, which was uh, mid February. And not only did she sign up to go to our conference, one of her good friends who joined with her just because you know she she you know heard Karen's excitement, but she also got product results. Some really you know this this woman, her name is Marilyn. We'll have her on another call. You know, not to get into a lot of detail, but she was in severe pain, and she got some amazing product results. She wanted to go to conference, you know. And then, Karen, it was, you know, Marilyn herself was telling one of her good friends out in Calgary. So she wanted to go to conference. So all four of us get on a plane together, three of them brand new. Um, Karen, you were back there 14 years ago, and now you go to conference, and you've seen, um, you know, we've still got the same product. But is there anything, you know, you can say, anything that stands out that got, you know, sort of you and your team there that, that um, you know, if somebody's listening? Well, I think now all the, <clears throat> excuse me, the wrinkles are out of the company, all the ups and downs, and everybody is so excited. The, excite, the excitement in that room was passionate. Like, it was, it was real, and it was like we were a family, and... I just think this company is going nowhere but up, and I think everybody needs to be a part of that. If you're not, you're missing the boat, so to speak. <clears throat> I think it's really important to get to events. Um, even when we have events in Toronto, it's a good three-and-a-half-hour drive for us. Our first event in January, we had one car with three people in it. We went two weeks ago, we had seven people. There's another meeting coming up in a couple of weeks. We're going to have 20 people. It's important to be there. Even if you learn one thing, go to the company events. It, they're amazing. And, and amazing. Get, and get people there. Okay, so now February comes along. Karen, you know, February comes along, and it's really exciting because, you know, some of you um, are new on the call, and, and some of the language that we use is not always familiar, but... You know, there's terms, and each term means you're ranking up a level, which also means you've built a bigger business, which also means you've built a bigger paycheck. So Karen's very second month was February, and she reached the gold level in February, which is very exciting. So Karen, what was your first month's paycheck, and what was your second, just starting this on a part-time business? Uh, my first paycheck was $329 for the month. Perfect. And my one for last month, is $1,293, and that's on a part-time basis. And I'll tell you, that, that'll change my life. That, that's a mortgage payment for a lot of people. And all I'm doing is sharing. It's pretty easy. Like, that's phenomenal. I'm, I'm excited. Woohoo! Exactly. And, you know, what I love, you know, even just to share a bit, uh, you know, about Karen. I mean, Karen um, is, is, you know, her life's great. She's in a great relationship right now. Her, her partner owns um, a Tim Hortons, and he knows. And Karen's witnessed, you know, the, what that takes, the kind of uh, money that takes to run, the kind of time that takes to run. Um, but, but Karen is an independent woman, woman who, who, you know, I admire and um, wanted her own thing. And I know she's going to really crush this and, and take this to other levels. And uh, her team is growing. They've got a great team. We just did a meeting last night in Toronto. So um, even before we get off, Karen, just something simple, because it was kind of exciting to hear you just took a dress back from conference to, <laughs> to, uh, to the dry camp. Yeah. What happened there? That's why I don't have a voice. <laughs> in my little town of Grand Bend, we have three dry cleaners. I drove a half an hour to a different dry cleaner because I happened to know the lady that worked there. And I went in with my dress. It was an excuse to go talk to her. And by the time I left there, I went to go talk about the product and the business to her. I was actually talking in front of 10 people. They all were interested. And it was just the timing. I drove a half an hour out of my way where I could have went five minutes 
but it was an excuse to go talk to this lady. And I just, you know what? It's going to cost me $10 extra to get my dress clean. It was well worth it because it gave me the opportunity to talk. And while I was talking, more people were listening and more people were listening. So you owe it to yourself and your friends and family. Just get out there and share. It's amazing. That's perfect. Well, you know what? Um, I am so glad. You know, we've become, we were even 15 years ago, um, and it seems like 15 years didn't pass, you know. So you <laughs> create great friendships. I'm so glad to be working with you again where, you know, things are happening here in Ontario and now out west. So uh, I'm going to turn it back over to John um, and or Keith and uh, see if you uh, have any closing remarks. Well, well th- thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you both, Karen and, and Lori, and uh, a phenomenal job, Karen, in a very short period of time. And well, welcome back home. And uh, you know, the, the, yes, the, I feel like I'm home. <laughs> <laughs> I, I know you do, and, and, and we're glad to have you back. And, and uh, you, you know, that, that's just one of, of, of so many stories of people who have been involved with Immunitech in the past that are kind of you know coming back because everything is happening, but. You know, for those of you who are new, who are once again listening for the first time, you say, hey, I was never part of this before. You want to be part of it for all the good reasons that Karen and Lori just shared with you here. You know, we're, we're a fun business. We're a growing business. We're a business that has its act together, and so many businesses, frankly, don't. Uh, when you look at them and you get under the hood and you really examine them, we, we, we truly do. And you'll find that out. And, I, I, you know, time doesn't allow for us to get into all those reasons now, but – we're a well-managed company. We're a young company in terms of how we think. We're managed and governed by a 39-year-old uh, individual that's running the company and now owns it. Um, and we're a company that's growing. Uh, 